I've never been scared of a vehicle. Well, boys, today's the day that some cocky YouTube kid from Indiana learns what a real Fast Cummins is and actually looks like. So Gabe Farrell is on his way out here to Limer today where we are meeting up and then we're headed down to Mexico to face off his Fast second gen. I think it's only a two-wheel drive Cummins. Six-speed manual, compound turbo, 300% over injectors. Woo, y'all, and I'm tired. You got coffee, dog? Did we I bring some grind home? Sorry. Now, one thing I don't think Gabe realizes is, you know, for those second gens, a weight reduction isn't formally classified as a broken dash. I'm sorry, it just don't qualify. Whereas good old eight ball over here. Yeah, we don't have that problem. Third gens for life, boys. You got so much hate in that TikTok the other day. That's not a second gen, that's a third gen. Nobody got the joke. I know. Now, in all seriousness, guys, Dave and I are good friends. We actually haven't formally met each other in person, but we've been connected on social media for a little while now. He's been pumping out some awesome content. Dude's pretty creative on TikTok. So today, he happened to be in pen. So today, yes, we are getting together. Somebody's ripping. MC Rippin's on their motorcycle. Cool. That wasn't your cue, dog. So we had some business out in Pennsylvania, reached out to me and said we should definitely get the Cummins together. He's got a really nice white second gen Cummins. It is fairly well done from what I understand. It's got a built motor, 300 over injectors, compound turbos. Uh, I do believe it's a two wheel drive truck, short bed. It's pretty clean, I'm not gonna lie. He's definitely been having a lot of fun with it. And when he got that thing, he kind of had the bright idea to challenge me and 8-Ball. And as we know, 8-Ball is quite the savage. <laughs> This thing's a beast. It made 1113 horsepower out at Firepunk about a year ago. We're running a dual S400 setup on this thing. It's a 467 on the manifold with a 480 in the atmosphere. 250 over injectors. We've got a 12 mil pump by Exergy supplying the fuel to those injectors. We've got a fully built head that's been firing by DNJ Precision. We are on a stock bottom end making some pretty crazy horsepower on fuel only 1113 at the wheels. Now the truck is actually detuned right now to make roughly 950 on a street tune it's a yeah. casual 950 on a street tune <laughs> but the big difference between gabe's truck and this truck is the fact that we're putting the power down through a fully built firepunk 48 re it's a nice gold beautiful transmission sitting in the transmission tunnel of this thing and it shifts awesome the power is being controlled through the anteater which firepunk is definitely very notorious for in the industry and man this thing shifts beautifully so it's going to be interesting to see gabe try and keep up with the shifting abilities of that which is in like the tenth of a second whereas he's going to be manually shifting a six speed and well if you don't know trucks really don't like to be shifted very quickly now i didn't necessarily plan for a race there are some things that i could have done better to prepare like traction bars we don't have any right now so the axle likes to kind of just dance along because all that power putting down and we're on 22 by 12 american force concave wheels on nitto 420 v's they're not necessarily a drag setup but i think gabe's going to be on a street wheel entire setup as well we did make some minor adjustments and put the baldies from the rear in the front that's about all we did to prepare oh that's not true we gave it a bat Yes, yeah, so we also cleaned it up. Not like it's going to matter for Gabe, though. He's not going to be able to see it. So this should be a pretty good time. I'm excited about this. We haven't really ever been challenged by anybody here on the vlog, so we're going to see how good old 8-Ball has prepared for this monumental day. Now, I did just get a DM from Gabe. He's going to be a little bit later. He got pulled over for going too slow. They said that his truck wasn't even worthy for the highway. I said, sir... You're shifting like a grandma. What are you doing? You actually got to get that thing up to speed, sir. It's illegal to go 25 miles an hour under the speed limit. The sad thing is, is a grandma would probably end up shifting that faster than he could. We got to set him up with some driving lessons. I interrupt today's race content to remind you guys that the end of Dream Diesel Giveaway number 18 is right around the corner. July 4th, aka Independence Day down here in the States, is the last day to grab your entries for this truck and $30,000 cash. Just a friendly reminder, Procrastination Nation, now is your time. <laughs> I remember when I first learned how to drive. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what was that sound? <laughs> oh my god. It's already grinding his gears. I ain't gonna lie, that thing looks sweet though. It looks pretty badass. Looks, really good. looks real aggressive. I love single cab short beds, and he's got a cow hood too. It's kind of cool seeing that the second gen and the third gen are actually like specced somewhat in the same. But dude, that shorty little box, look at that thing. Oh, he's got traction bars. He might have us. Oh man, I'm nervous. <laughs> should we should we pull out now? Yeah, let's, let's just go home. What? Let's just get get out of here. Oh wow. <laughs> Throws rod. <laughs> he's got a clutch he can press. <laughs> <laughs> it's just reverse, I think. That's pretty badass. It looks good. It's tiny. Yeah, it's so small. Yeah, holy crap.
Yeah, well, it looks like you caught every species of bug that Pennsylvania offers. Literally all of them. Literally What's up, all bro? of them. Nice all to meet you, nice finally, to meet man. You. Dude, it's a pleasure, bro. Huh. It's a lot cleaner than mine. <laughs> <laughs> I hate to break it to you. It makes a lot more power, too. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Nice to meet you. you Pleasure. Too. So you live in Pennsylvania? Yeah. I kind of put like two and two together through your post. Mine's mounted backwards. Hey, wow. Whoa. Is that for aerodynamic purposes? That's for uh, boost purposes. Okay. And then you have a manifold and I have a not manifold. Interesting. Is that custom? Yeah, it's custom with a K. Nice, dude. I heard K's uh, create more performance. Yeah. Is that K good? is crazy. Wow. You got powder coating in here too? No, that's, that's, that's paint. Is that paint? That's, I think it's actually cool. It's more lightweight though, right? It's crayon. Okay. Cran. Nice. Yeah. Is is that, is that is that for like heat dissipation? Uh, it, it, it can be. It can be. Unless yeah. it melts off, then, then we're f You have one of them fancy things on the top of your motor there too. This, this thing? That thing, yeah, That's it's fancy. Right. I mean, it's usually polished, but you know, oil got everywhere. Hey, hey, that was know. that was part of your oil change though, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. You actually don't have to change this oil. It's self-changing. Okay. So you just add oil and then you don't have to actually drain Sounds it. Sounds way easier yeah, than it's, doing the actual change it's itself. A lot better. Perfect. Yeah, it doesn't, uh, it doesn't overheat ever. Like, it runs very cold, 90 the whole way here. Did you have that with you when you were at her house? Yeah, she, she builds trucks, like, actually. Like, I just fake build trucks, yeah. she, like, actually yeah, builds yeah. trucks. <laughs> well, I can kind of tell, I mean, her truck's way cleaner than yours. Ooh. Actually, it's 100% <laughs> true. No, I completely agree. <laughs> it's really <laughs> clean, though. <laughs> I was kind of admiring from a distance on Instagram. You got to see it in like person. It, it, how, how long was the drive here? Three and a half. Three and a half hours. I thought it was an... See, I messed up. I, oh, no. I searched up... Land, you Lancaster, messed up? Lan what? Dude? Lancaster? Yeah. Ohio also okay. has one. A lot closer than <laughs> Yeah, this I one. know. I know. It's it's on the eastern side of Yeah, I, I was place. like, oh, it's like an hour. Not. Right. It's been a ton of fun messing with people on Instagram. I love bro. It. Everyone's like, are you it. actually like angry? And I'm like, nah, dude. I'm just fing. Extremely. With the guy. Like, I like those wheels a lot. Yeah. I had the same the same cut for my 30s. They're like yeah. my favorite American Force ever. Were, were you on 12 wide still on that other set of wheels? Yeah. Though? Okay. They weren't concave though. These are actually wider. And then it got a little more meat. So they actually more. have like an eerie similarity between like kind of the setups right now. Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Except mine has shred. Is that for weight reduction? Yes. Nice. <laughs> I was like, I'm not going to clean it up because I don't feel like washing it. It's been like so miserably hot outside. But the other day I'm like, yo, we got it. I Let's like these that. seats. Look at these seats. SRT 10. Yeah, they came out That's of a V10. A they came out of a V10. <laughs> no, yeah, this that, is a V10. That's a V10 yeah. Cummins. Yeah. Inline, inline V10. Inline V10. Inline V10. Yeah. Yeah. In, in, yeah. 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 Yes. We actually did like a custom build where all 10 of the Vs are in the line. We just took the cylinder piston size and just cut them in half. Gotcha, gotcha. And yeah. then they kind of fit in there. That equals 12, but yeah. we just left two out. That's actually a 4BT. Okay. And then I just added two more. Nice. Yeah. You just like oh, super glued yeah, them together? Pretty, no, Elmer's. Elmer's. Dude, that holds. I heard it's really good. It is. Yeah. So you, I did like it's more available too. Boosted launches at like 100. You go to like arts and crafts store and stuff. Where you picked up uh, your, is that where you got your crown bed, too? Bed, bath, and beyond actually. Okay. Yeah. Nice. I'm so glad we we're on the same. <laughs> <laughs> But when you had reached out, I'm like, that's kind of cool, man, because I feel like we were reciprocating the same energy, like, back and forth. Yes. Like, like we were throwing pretty hard digs at one another, but it was, like, all in love, yeah. you know what I mean? So, and then I'm like, dude, it said to Jake, I'm like, we're definitely, like, the pathetic version of Mayweather. Mayweather and Paul. <laughs> yes, <literally. laughs> so I was thinking, if I hit every shift perfectly and you blow the tires off, you might not beat me as bad. It's true. It's yes. actually very true. Yeah. So what's the statistical probability that you're going to hit every shift perfectly? I've done it one time. One time? Yeah. And how many times? Out of like a hundred. Jake, so, you're a statistician. Can you do that math for us real fast? Uh, carry the one. Like roughly point. I'm going to go to college. Zero nine percent or Sounds something Sounds about like right. That's your odds. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> All right, walk me through the power adders. All right, sucker, so my dude. dad just bought me this truck last week. It's pretty sick. It's a 24 valve Cummins. It's got ARP head studs. It's got two, three alternators. So this is a S480 alternator. This is an S364 alternator. They work really good together. Uh, it makes like 70 pounds of boost. It's got 300 horsepower injectors. It's a VP truck. That's the only thing that sucks. Did you not peep up it yet? Not yet. Oh, okay. I've only I had it for had a week. It. Got it. Got yeah. it. Got it. So that is a little bit of a maybe. swap to do in like this much time. Yeah, I, I thought about it, but Craigslist is just ain't working out right now. I can't find a deal. Oh, <laughs> uh, what else? Craigslist. Ah, favorite part. Gotta come inside. I'm not as cool as Jack. I don't got a. I don't got the the little drive thing. You know, you put it in drive. Mm -hmm. Mine, mine. You have to like. You have to put it in drive like six different ways. Don't pay attention to that. <laughs> Wah, wah, wah. It's got 
it's got a bunch of drives and sometimes it turns into seven if you bang it really hard there's a seventh gear it's hidden it is it's one of those hidden it's, seven speeds. i've been able to figure it out i've heard rumor about those but yeah. it's like the great white buffalo yeah and then if you want to go like really fast throw it all the way over here and throw an r for race mode yep i i won't do that today you're not dude thank you yeah. i appreciate the i didn't want to embarrass you in front of all your I fans I know. I know. I I been, and it's my birthday it, so you know i gotta it is actually my birthday though. Happy birthday, man. Thank you. Yeah, I'm 20 now. I'm old as shit. You're 20 years old? He's yeah. Holy shit. And making, making me feel old. He's... Oh, dude, that's a weight saving. It is. We were actually going to take out the seats. I was going to make her lay on the floor. But... <laughs> Put her in the bed. Yeah. I'm also YouTube. empty right now. So All right. You're, you're getting blocked. Yeah, I saved definitely. like 5,000 pounds. I have a full pounds. tank of fuel and a fat ass, so. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> so mine weighs like, that's, the, that's another thing. You, I weigh like... 5,000 pounds in my Ford Ranger, and you weigh about 8,000 pounds. This is an F450. This is an F450 yep. Dually. Where is your F450 Dually, by the way? Is it at home? Uh, the repoed one yeah. or the non Either one. They're both sexy. Yeah, they're both up at my house. I only live like two minutes. I only drove like three and a half hours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you only drove two hours. And I got See, to the I end of the tunnel. See, I knew he was going to slow. Uh, I was going to the end of the tunnel, and I saw a cop, and I was like, oh, that's cool. And then he pulled out, and I was like, oh, that's cool. Do I really feel like running in Pennsylvania? And then, and then I didn't. You're welcome. So he gave me, fast. yeah, he gave me a, a speeding ticket, uh, a, regis a, ticket. a registration ticket. I don't know why he would give me that. And then gave me a, the tire sticking out too far. Oh no, he didn't go there. Did I he? have a dually sitting at home that's 120 inches wide that Ooh. I don't get pulled over for. And I put 12 wides with no spacers. Now I get stopped here. Welcome to Western PA. What the? F <laughs> yeah. And I actually genuinely couldn't. I thought he was joking. Yeah. It's like nope. no way. They don't stick out. Is it fast enough you can just levitate? Yes. It actually doesn't make contact with the ground. I can't. Yeah. So fast. That's impressive. Yeah. I have bold tires. I just decided to use traction up front anyway. I'm I've going been looking at this. Drive he has the bald ones on the front too. Yeah. Does that mean that it does front wheel drive burnouts? Mm, I, I I didn't opt in for that. Oh. Yeah. It's a, it's a high quality option. Yeah. yeah. I, I, I do like that mode. You can do like the one wheel. Yeah. Thing that's what I do. Okay. On that one. Okay. Yeah. 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 I'm saving Because when you put 100% to one, it's faster? Yes, yeah, so you actually just do a 360 if you have the one tire. Cool. So we're planning on doing that today? I am doing that okay. today. Okay. I will demonstrate. <laughs> <laughs> get on the highway and start driving home after that. He's like, yeah, I'm all right. He just makes it right instead of using the car one. He drove three and a half hours to get waxed. I almost kind of feel bad. Yeah, maybe we should let him have the first one. Say we like... That's a confidence boost. Yeah, yeah, and then just right. absolutely Just don't tell anybody it. we're doing that, guys. Unnaturally aspirated. I didn't know that state started to provide cool plates like that. The enthusiast line of license plates? I think it is. Okay, nice. I just understood why he asked why the cop gave him a registration ticket. <laughs> I don't know why. It all makes sense now. <laughs> Propelling 
way forward putting gaps on Mr. Gapplebee's. Just feel like you're exhausted after working so hard. I give you like a one mile jump start? Sure. Alright, cool. Perfect. Oh, that's why he was losing. I'm gonna win now. Now you have down force. Up force. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! I'm gonna spin through six. Thank you. You're such a kind guy. <laughs> I just want to be hospitable while you're in my seat. Yeah, that's my birthday. Come on. Yeah, exactly. Man, I, I got a birthday too. Yeah. Well, you really? You're a winner. Oh, mom. thanks. <laughs> If you start in race mode, you should be instant power. Is it boosted lunchtime? It's boosted lunchtime. Oh God, I'm not prepared. Here we go. <laughs> oh my God, dude. <laughs> So hard, dude. Yeah, I know, bro. I literally went like this. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> it scared my truck so bad it broke. It literally said, and everything just started freaking out. It, your truck did a wheelie, by the way. You're, it 100% it felt that like I was, was Elon Musk taking ground. off the spikes, bro. Like that was ridiculous. It has never hooked that good. It might have something to do with this tarmac that we pulled on, or maybe the temperature in Mexico. I'm not even joking. Every light on the dash turned on. <laughs> It said, what is going on? It turned off, turned back on twice. <laughs> Oh no! Don't touch it. <laughs> it hot? No, but this happens. Oh god! Oh god, they're coming back. Just, why? All right, no cap. 
most ignorant thing I've ever been in, been a part of. This is ridiculous. I have, I have been in a twin turbo Lamborghini, and this feels way crazier than that. I was not scared. This, I have never been scared in a vehicle that that was pretty freaking scary. I drive a monster truck. You know that, right? I, I drive a monster. That's that's way scarier than that. That was nonchalant compared to this. This is ridiculous. I like that. Paintball is very much bigger. Yeah. It's uh, a nose attack gloss army green. Pictures definitely don't do it. No, justice. I was like, oh, that's pretty cool. It almost has like the same finish as a paint job and it's reflective too. It's crazy, dude. You can actually buff this, get it to look a little bit more polished. When I initially envisioned the truck, I'm like, this wrap is kind of a risk. Yeah. Like, cause it's either gonna be loved or hated. That's what I did with mine. I wrapped the truck half and half. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I saw that. I saw oh. that black and white, right? Yeah, black and marble. I don't know which one I like more. That one's, uh, never mind. No, that one sucks. <laughs> Yeah, that one's a little bit more up your alley, man. Yeah, I like the that. The big lifted dually. I mean, it's kind of like a man after your own heart here because you're all about that dually life. I, everything I buy just ends up either turning into a dually or it is a dually. They're both claddy too. Oh, oh yeah, boy. Man, it, it's a, I'm blessed, dude. Oh, Honestly, like God. that. that's my big thing is I'm just super grateful for this opportunity. And there's never a day that I don't walk out here, bro, and look at these things. Like, Fords, holy hell. She doesn't like Fords and she's, she's like Mesmerized freaking out right now. Why well, I, I take that as a compliment. That, I really appreciate it. Somebody's gonna get lucky, man. Like I don't know where this truck's gonna end up, but hopefully my house. I'm definitely I do actually buy your merch, so yeah, yeah, yo, I appreciate that. You were down at uh, Daytona yep, with one of our shirts. Yeah. I appreciate that, man. It means oh, a lot. Course. It means a lot. I'd make for another gnarly future collab, dude, delivering a truck to you. Oh, I would, what, they, they would all say it's fake though. Oh, hundred <laughs> percent. That's 100%. what I always think because I want to give away trucks one day. That's like one of my dreams. Is because I see like the reaction videos, those are insane. Yeah, it's so cool. Yeah, it's awesome. Yeah, it never gets old, man. It's like a fine wine. The behind the scenes of YouTube getting those thumbnails and thinking through it critically. Look at the stance on the boy. My goodness. So it's cool that we got together, Gabe. That was a lot of fun, man. Yep. What do you think of April? Yeah, it's fast. Very, pretty fast? Very fast. Not pretty. I'm happy you called fast. me out. Yeah, you're welcome. It was an opportunity I couldn't pass up for obvious reasons. Thank you. Uh, my truck, we're going to go home and rebuild the motor again and hopefully <laughs> be able to be half as fast as your truck. Yeah, dude. Uh, I mean, are, are, is that a future challenge? You, I'll have to come back. Yeah. Challenge accepted. All right. I'll take it. For the vlog, make it official, bro. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> I'll have to bring the big truck out too and do some like wheelies and run over some stuff. Yeah, when I saw on Instagram that you were towing your gooseneck on the trailer hitch receiver, See, I'm like, I really hope he doesn't come into Pennsylvania like that. <laughs> well, they I pulled me over for barely sticking out tires, so they probably would have had a field day with that. Yeah, they would have. Yeah. I probably would have had to come get you. Yeah, I would have called you. <laughs> so <laughs> to, that, to, look what you made me do. They're not all that friendly. <laughs> Take it from a guy that found out the hard way. <laughs> well, dude. I'm sorry that you had to drive all the way out here to lose. Nope, nah, that's kind of worth but it. But I'm happy that you did. Yeah. And I'm happy you got to experience 8-Ball. I saw an 8-Ball eight, eight wheelie. Yes, 8-Ball wheelie. They picked the entire front driver's side wheel up. What's up, Ted? Nice to see you, buddy. Hi, dude. Hi, buddy. And uh, yeah, I think, I, I think I'm going to fire under your feet yes, to make more power. And that yeah. is what it's all about, my friends. The win or lose thing, it was all in good fun. I truthfully do not care. I didn't care about the outcome no, at all. Me neither. So uh, what's, what's, the, what's the plan now for the second gen, dude? You're going to... Oh, I think we're going to sell it on the way home. Okay, yeah. okay. Uh, Walk the rest of the way if it sells on the way? Yeah. Okay. Definitely mm -hmm. going to look for third gens on the way home. April's not for sale, I'm sorry. Maybe a white one. You're giving it a look. Maybe a You're gonna, it's very seductive. Single cab, horses. <laughs> Front end swap. Front end, yeah. Compound turbos. Nice little drive. I can be your official consultant on how to make power. Yes. You can and um, I did I did make a reservation. There's Gabblebees. It's actually right about now, so we should, we should, are you hungry? I'm hungry. Yeah, All right, cool, let's, let's go eat that. <laughs> really, really good guy. Very genuine, very down to earth, man. We had an absolute blast. So family just got up here. We're gonna be hanging out with Jack Jr. and the extended family here this afternoon. But I just wanna wrap up in closing and say, dude, Gabe, I really appreciate you taking time out of your day to travel three and a half hours out from your girlfriend's house to Lancaster, Pennsylvania to hang out, film, and have a really good time. It's not about the competition. It's about the camaraderie, in my personal opinion. And if he does take that truck to the next level, then I have a reason to reach back out to Firepunk and potentially d &J and maybe do something just a little bit more special. Not that this truck needs any more power right now, though, because I'll tell you what, this thing is an absolute animal. And I want you guys to take that from Gabe's reactions himself. Oh my God. 
god. Video will never, ever, ever truly capture the aggressive nature of eight ball. And that's why it gets me so excited. That's why I get so pumped up every single time I'm driving that thing because it's just an absolute animal. And I gotta tell you guys what, I always like to reinforce this as Gabe did for me in his video, which I'm very grateful for. But man, he's just very candid, very in the moment and super down to earth. That's what I love about YouTube is as I said to his channel, it's just all about the relationships because in life, when people are their priority and relationships are at the forefront of what you do, genuinely anything is possible. So as Gabe said, this truck does no justice until you see it in person and you might be doing exactly that. So grab your entries before the giveaway is over, guys. It ends July 4th. This truck and $30,000 cash could be going home with you. I look forward to seeing y'all right where Gabe and I just were today here in Pennsylvania to hand over the keys and the title and the cash.